I'm Lucario. And I'm Thomas. And today on the Vegan Cooking Show with Bobby and Brent, <laughs> we're gonna show you how to make this fried pineapple rice. Whoa! That looks amazing, That's Brent. Delish. Oh. And makes a great dish. Next. On Now You Know. Okay, Brent, so. You look like at rhymes? This. Do you I, like rhymes, boys and girls? You know me. We have history. <laughs> I like to rhyme. Always out of time. That was really bad. You know what, Brent? Yes. Let's let's focus on what the point of this episode is. Yes. What is the point, Bobby? As we all know, yes. watching at home, mm -hmm. I am poor. Yes. I live on the streets. I have no money. It's very clear. Look this, at this. This guy. is my job. I just cook, <laughs> and the only thing I get paid in is to eat the food. That is the only way I get paid. Sounds it's, like a pretty good deal to me. I don't know. It's it's pretty good. You yeah. know, it's pretty good. I yeah. live down in the cupboards with the puppets. That's um, good. So you yeah. know, when I'm really really hungry yeah. for Chinese food, for you example, know, some kind of stir fry, mm. I want to go buy some with my friends, but it's like absurdly expensive. Yeah, well, you spend like 10 bucks for like a pint or something? Even more sometimes. Really? Wow. Even... You're going to some, some fancy Chinese food restaurants, I think. But Brent, what, what if I told you yes. that you... Me? ...can make fried rice yeah. at home for like way cheaper? Um, I, I would be down with the clown if All that right. were the case. Well, clown you will, you will do because <laughs> okay. we are today yeah. clowning around with this recipe. So we're going to be doing something a little controversial today. Controversy? Yes. Pineapple. Pineapple in our fried rice. Now, why is that controversial? Well, Brent, I like pineapple. For some weird reason, yeah. people don't like pineapple in things. Yeah, that's weird, huh? And like, I eat pizza. Yeah, pizza, I know. We already, we kind of delved into this controversy of a pineapple buffalo pizza. And I love pineapple on anything, so. Pre yeah, no, right? I like it on cereal. Mm -hmm. I like it in my tea. I like it on my cereal. I like it in my milk. I like it on my cereal that's in milk. How I you like it that? in my milk that's saturating cereal. <laughs> well, you really like milk and cereal, Brian, huh? <laughs> what do you mean? So we're gonna be uh, adding pineapple. And to our fried rice. To our fried rice, and that's, that's how the rice crumbles. That's now, Brent, you may be asking, why, why are we, are we adding, adding pineapple? pineapple? Well, you see, Brent, mm -hmm. there are benefits okay. to adding pineapple. Okay, yeah. Um, you explain that to me, Bobby, because I am just a dumb, dumb boy. Okay, are you ready? I'm so are you ready, you dumb, dumb? I've never had to know anything about pineapples in my life, <laughs> you know? Are you ready, you dumb, dumb? dumb. Pineapples support your immune system. Okay. Strengthen your bones. Increase your eye health. Eye health, I need that. I have terrible eyesight. Contacts, baby. Yeah, me too. I, I don't even know what I'm looking at anymore. <laughs> you know? Contains vitamin C. Okay. And is it way more exotic and exciting than those boring oranges. <laughs> it's a way more exotic and exciting. <laughs> I love that little touch. That, that's a great Matthew. phrasing. Was this tr like translated to Japanese and then back into English? I don't know. Was that, was, that a, was that a Matthew touch? No, that, that's pretty cool, Bobby. <laughs> it sounds like there's a lot of good things going on there. <laughs> yeah. I, I was very surprised to hear about the eye health part of that. That's interesting. Yeah, yeah actually, it, you know, there is a uh, rumor going around that mm. carrots are not Rumors actually happen. as good for your eyes yeah. as we may have thought growing up. Mm. Interesting. So pineapples are in fact good for your eyes. So. Okay. Mind blow. Well, we have carrots and pineapples in this, so we're really, we're gonna- We're covering all our bases. We're covering all our bases. Yeah. So, you know, who knows? Who knows? Who knows? But yeah. if, if one of them is good for our eyes, then we're covered there, so. Also, Brent, I Thank have a really God. fun fact for you real quick. Okay. I know I, we're, we're dragging on here, but. Yeah, you know what? I just like, I like facts, but I really like fun facts. Did you know that most people think that pineapples grow on trees? I am one of those. They, where do they grow? What? I, I didn't know a pineapple doesn't grow on a tree. Oh. You have to guess now because you know they don't grow on a tree. So okay. where do you think they grow? Um, do they grow like on a bush? Yeah. A I mean, shrub? Yeah, pretty much. It's a just like, it's, like a pineapple is basically its own like its own plant. Like plant. And then around it, it's just like the leaves. Oh. It's on it, the ground. It's almost like its own mini shrub. Yeah, sort of? kind of. Interesting. It just grows right out I of the ground. I had no idea. I would have never guessed that. Isn't that interesting? That is a fun fact. Now you know. Shall we get ready to move on to the next step? Yeah, we should probably let everyone know this is the stuff they're going to need to make this fried rice oh, at home. Oh boy, we rarely went on long, yeah, didn't we? Yeah, th that's okay. That's what editing is for. That's and true. And then also, um, here are the things you're going to need to um, prep your ingredients and whatnot to make this fried rice. Awesome. All right. First, we're going to cook our rice in boiling water. Set the burner to high and leave for 10 minutes. Then, we're gonna start chopping our vegetables that we're later going to saute in our wok. Start sauteing your onions and garlic until caramelized. Once that's caramelized, 
Then add the rest of your vegetables to the wok. Our rice is cooked, looking delish. Yeah. Our veggies and pineapple and nuts are looking all really nice and cooked. Oh. So all we gotta do now, Bobby, is combine them together and add in our soy sauce. That's it? That's it, my guys. Woo! This is looking good. <laughs> Look at you. You ready to sauce it up, my guy? I'm ready to sauce it down. I'm ready to sauce it sideways. I'm ready to sauce it inverted. Brent, we yeah. finished. Yes, we our made our fried stir rice. fry, as you would call it, our but fried rice. Stirred fried rice. Our fried rice that's been stirred. Yes. We, you know, we did. We stirred it. We fried stirred it. Stirred a bunch. So, without further ado, should we just like get? Yeah. Into let's see this? if our cheap ish rice <laughs> is worth it. What do you think? Count of three. Sure. One, two, two three. A. Two Ooh. weeks in a row, Brent. Wow. I'm really digging this. This is really good. Me too. And uh, we made a lot of food. We could have made even more with mm. what we had. So mm -hmm. we're really saving a bunch of money here rather than getting takeout. If you get takeout every night, you're gonna be spending like seven times the amount you would just to make this. Right. And it would give you the same amount of food. And not to mention if you get it delivered and you gotta pay for delivery tip costs and, and tips that. and all that. Forget that. Take that tip money and put it in your savings jar. Just put it back in your own pocket. <laughs> I wanna finish this, Brent. Yeah, so let's okay. wrap up the show. Let's wrap up the show. Thank you so much for watching this episode of Vegan Cooking with Bobby and Brent featuring Thomas and Lucario. Go on Patreon. Make sure you support my living wage. Yes. Because so that Bobby can stop living with the puppets under the cupboard. Yeah, you know? I'm, I'm getting sick of of it's rigatoni. Cramped. It's just like kicking me in the face with yeah, his non-existent legs. It's very cramped in there for an actual human mm. to fit in there. It's like not really like a person was not meant to live in that, no. such a space. And you really can feel it when you're sleeping there. Yeah. It's so tasty. Yes. So let's wrap this up. We've been going for a while. Hopefully, I don't interrupt myself again.